Hello, vlog. Where are we? We're actually vlogging out in here. Three, I think, is this our first vlog for this year? No, the Skull and Burns one was. Yeah, anyways, so Game on Cancer has invited me um, to Generation Games to talk on their panel about when I grow up, I want to be a content creator. So I'm very nervous and all that jazz, but also on Friday, I went to a VIP launch event for Super Neon, a light festival at Luna Park. So I'll roll some clips in now and then we'll go to Generation Games. But I'm super nervous, let's go. Wow, wait. How you feeling? What are your hopes? Hello. This is for the YouTube video, by the way. Oh, okay, good. Great start. We're off to a great start for the vlog. Oh uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. I don't know if this is supposed to be flowers or like coral. We're going to do some graffiti in this in this event. You gotta plug yourself at these events. Oh, you forgot the capital H. Yeah, there we go. That looks good. She has better writing than me. There we go, don't forget the S. Oof. There we go. There you put TTV if you want. Or, ooh. That, solid. Solid. Works. Solid. I like it. Holy! Oh Jesus, people are taking selfies. Thoughts? Thoughts? Trippy. Very trippy. Very trippy. by the Twitch party now, probably won't record anything. And then yeah, panel time on Sunday. Um, yeah, here's the panel that we're doing. They're playing bangers, so it's gonna be pretty chill. Um, and look at this, all content creators with their and stuff managers, down. managers too. Uh, yeah, Ma manager, manager. Look at look who's holding the camera. That, and that, I, I that shows who, that, bag bitch, bag bitch my bag oh, here. Hey, I got us the <laughs> so yeah, we're about to go up in like what, 10, 20? Um, get my, you'll get my amazing footage, my recording skills. Yeah, and then should be G, should be G, hopefully. Um, and then we got tattoo after. Pretty good day. Pretty good day. That's it. Amazing people, amazing vibes, you know, out here. All right, I'll see you guys in when I'm on stage. Uh, yeah, as well as that, probably monitor and another screen, depending on your phone, a tablet, making sure you have two screens at all at one time when you're streaming, just so you can see chat, notifications, all that jazz. Um, and yeah. Um, yeah, I started on Twitch for like three months and then I moved to Mixer for six months and that's where I kind of grew and then sadly shut down, ROP. Um, and then I went back to Twitch and then yeah, I kind of kicked off from there and then started going on YouTube, uploading on there, then TikTok and all that stuff. But nowadays it's really, you can't really just stream anymore. So I think the best thing to do is kind of, if you're playing say a video game like Fortnite, Overwatch, if you're just playing just edit little things, post on TikTok, YouTube Shorts, grow a community from that. And Re yeah. Repurposing. Um, yeah, just touching back on that. As long as you're passionate, informative, funny, or just pretty much engaging, you can pretty much make content on anything as long as you you hold those standards and stuff like that. Like for me, example, I make a lot of content on Jurassic Park, Jurassic World, something I'm really passionate about, something I'm a fan of, and that's like my side thing from content creation. And it sometimes does well better than what I actually, which is surprising, but yeah, as long as you're engaging, passionate about it and informative, I think you can really do anything and take it to the moon. Yeah, no, the, it's pretty, it might get a bit deep here, but your closest friends will probably, will make fun of you, probably, that's the harsh reality. You will lose a bit of people here and there and stuff like that. But at the end of the day, if, as long as you're passionate about it, then those opinions shouldn't really care and all that jazz. But um, yeah, there'll be kind of just bullies out there and stuff like that. And that's just something that you have to be aware of and stuff like that. Not everyone's a nice person. But yeah, as long as you got that, you got a strong mindset behind you, you can, 
you can get through it. Uh, another thing to point out, if, I don't know if with you guys, but it's hard to like switch it off. Oh, yes. I think that's another point. Yes. Um, <laughs> especially when you're content creation, you see trends and stuff like that. Say you just finished work and then you finish creating content or whatever, and then you see something new come out. It's kind of like, okay, I gotta jump on that and stuff like that. So it's, it's very hard to switch off from the digital world because even when you want to take a break and browse social media, you're still looking at stuff for content creating and stuff like that. So I can't go to an event without going, oh, I need to film what's yeah. going on here. Yeah. Like I need to yeah. show everyone what I went to today. So Literally. yeah. Even going to like dinners and stuff, it's like, oh, content. Yeah. <laughs> Capture everyone that's here yeah. and the food. And the camera eats first. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 um, yeah, NJ Highways on everything. Um, yeah, please sub, please follow. Doesn't hurt. <laughs> please like and subscribe. Yeah, Thank please. We, got, we did an avatar video yesterday on Fortnite, and I'm going to get an avatar tattoo in about a uh, couple minutes. Like oh, 40 cool, so minutes. He has to like run right after this. <laughs> no, that's fine. Alrighty, we're at the Generation Games with Jurassic Hello. Coloring Book. Um, yeah, I'm, about to, I'm almost going to do my panel. I booked in to get a Fortnite tattoo, so this is going to be fun. Yeah, you know, I got a team tattooed on me, so now it's time to get a Fortnite tattoo. Ah, nerves, nerves, nerves. But um, yeah, I'll record a bit of the panel, show you guys what it's about, show me the stuttering or throwing up on people. And yeah, it should be good. But um, this is the, the team, you know. Um, but yeah, I'll show you the tattoo soon as well. Hi, hello. We are getting a uh, Fortnite tattoo. It's weird. I can see everything up upside down, but it's all G. It's all G. See? We're laying down. I, I'm, I'm falling asleep. I'm number now. Alrighty, well, we're done at Generation Games. What a very busy weekend. And then next week we're off in Melbourne, so that's gonna be fun. It looks like a kind of a bloody mess at the moment. But, yeah, but at the moment, you know, we've got second skin on it. It's normal for a tattoo to look like that. Yeah, no, it was great. It was a great time. So shout out Dr. Pickle as well for aftercare and all that jazz. And let me get the Instagram up before I forget because I can't remember my artist's name off my heart. But be sure, the name. but go follow her Instagram. I'll put it in the description as well. But yeah, we got tatted up and I'm happy to try out Dr. Pickle Aftercare as well. We also made some business moves, so hopefully, Can fingers crossed. Yeah, you, oh yeah, we were probably going to show your tattoo. I forgot about my haul, thank you very much. Look at that sexy Ned Flames. Wow, we. It's by D Tag. Go follow him. I'll, I'll, I'll tag him in there as well. But um, yeah, we're in the city. You know, South by Southwest, uh, you guys, if you guys watch that vlog, you guys will probably know what this looks like. But um, yeah, another day in the city, good time, did a panel. I'm ready to have a nap and then get ready for a big weekend next weekend as well. Flying. But yeah, sorry if this vlog is all over the place, but I think we can make something out of it. But yeah, much love and I'll see you guys in the next one. Told him last year that I've been up next. Can't take calls, but I send that text from way downtown, but it's just still.